Takashi 69, him, his lawyers, the whole world was thinking he's getting released today. Not going to happen. He's getting sentenced to another year. He's going to do about two years total. He will get out of federal prison at the end of next year. The judge took his crimes very seriously. He accepted the government's position that this is one of the greatest cooperators of all time, that this guy snitched on not just the gang, but the leaders of the gang. This guy told them about crimes they didn't even know about, criminals that they didn't even know about. He locked all these people up for a big amount of time. The judge acknowledged that. The judge also heard from the defense lawyers, and he acknowledged that this guy's got a tough story. He grew up, you know, his biological father was doing heroin, got kicked out of the house by the mom, grew up as a single parent. His stepdad eventually was murdered on the street. Tough upbringing but ultimately what the judge said is what this comes down to is this guy was you know the gang was into drugs and they were into guns and they were into robbery but they didn't start shooting at rappers until Takashi came around that's a lot of shooting and he's got to do some time one more year Takashi's judge feeling extra spicy this morning. He gave him two years. Takashi's already served 13 months. He's going to serve about one more year. Before sentencing him, he delivered riveting remarks. There were lots of jokes, laugh out loud moments in the courtroom. Takashi's biological father stood up. He told him, sit down. Now's not your time to chance to talk. You lost that opportunity many years ago. He was talking about social media. He said he follows the memes. He thinks they're funny also. He was talking about whether releasing Takashi would lead to more gang violence. He said, hey, I'm not worried about that. I don't think any gang is ever going to associate with a snitch like you. But ultimately, this was not a laughing matter for the judge. And the judge told Takashi that he's not acknowledging his role, that the arguments he's making do not accept responsibility the way they should. He is not some kid who was trying to feed his daughter, and he's not some kid who didn't have role models. No, he had a record label. He had tons of role models. He chose to be part of this gang. He used this gang to get further in his career. They weren't involved in shooting. They, he got them involved. He put the money up that got them to shoot a Chief Keef, to shoot a Trippy Red, to shoot a Casanova. That's on him, and he needs to think about it for one more year behind bars. Judge Engelmeyers. Mic check one two one two. Cloud tokens here. Make sure you subscribe for more content. If you don't, I will harass you in the comments. This is a known fact. Do not test me. Alright, so look. You know the vibes. So today, everybody thought, especially Six Nine fans, thought he was going to get out today on time served. And it seemed like it was trending in that direction that he was going to get out today because the prosecution, who was against Six Nine, recommended time served. The defense who defends 6ix9ine recommended time serve. And the government agreed with that, but it was all up to the judge. But the judge wasn't having it. The judge said 6ix9ine was too violent. He did too much to society negatively, and he gotta pay for it. He said the 13 months he served, which is a year and a month, isn't enough for all the things he did. The judge named the things he did. Put a hit on Chief Keith or Tato, which is Chief Keith's cousin. He shot up Trippy Red's bus. He robbed rap a lot artists. He did so many things or ordered his gang to do so many things because he was the leader, according to the judge, in the RICO charges, that he just couldn't let him out. So he gave him two years in total. He already served one, so he'll serve another one year and he'll get out late 2020. As the lawyer said, who's been on the case since the beginning. But y'all let me know what y'all think about this. Are y'all happy 6ix9ine didn't get out? Or are y'all mad? Let me know. Bye.